Coming up next on Fox 17. This day will set the tone for the remainder of the school year. New set of challenges for some mid-state students as they head back into the classroom. Middle Tennessee's only primetime news, Fox 17 News at 9. Summer break is over for Metro, Williamson, and Macon County students. Teachers at Napier Enhanced Options School are pushing hard to achieve higher standards as the lowest performing elementary school in the state. Meantime, other metro schools are focusing more on including kindergarten students with disabilities and EL students into the rest of the population. And those students at Napier Elementary and Metro that Stacy just mentioned got a great gift today from the United Way. All of the students receiving a free backpack on this, their very first day of school. The backpacks, which were full of school supplies, were handed out by volunteers from the United Way. Napier is one of the poorest performing schools in the entire state, but its new principal says making sure that every student had the supplies they need really gets them started off at least on the right foot. That is so meaningful. Each child will walk away uh, knowing that someone cares about what's going on in his or her life. And we are just glad about all of those things so that uh, United Way has become a partner with us here at Napier. And teachers at that school got a free gift today as well, resource kits which contain instructional supplies.